After completing its feeding, the female age searches for dark and safe places where blood digestion can take place, which takes about four days. The ingested blood is necessary for a reproductive process. as it is fundamental for the development and maturation of the oocytes. Both Aedes aegypti as well as Aedes albopictus females lay their eggs on the side of water containers right above the water line. These water storages, denominated breeding sites, can be natural or artificial as well as open water reservoirs, abandoned tires in shady locations, plant vases, open water storage containers, inappropriately discarded garbage and plastic materials. Oviposition initiates at the moment the pregnant females finds the appropriate place in the environment. Humidity is detected by sensory organs located at the final portion of the abdomen and simultaneously in the reproductive apparatus. In the ovaries, the oocytes are displaced through the lateral oviducts. As it passes through the copulatory bursa, a spermatozoa penetrates through the micropyle, fertilizing the oocytes, thus forming the egg. The eggs are dispersed in small groups of 3 to 10 in more than one breeding site. With approximately 1 mm in length, at the time of oviposition, they are white and in contact with air, they become darker in color until they become black 2 hours later. Complete embryo development inside the egg takes approximately two to three days. This variation in time depends on the environmental temperature. Once embryonic development is complete, the eggs remain viable for approximately one year. In this image of the Aedes aegypti egg, obtained by scanning electron microscopy associated with confocal microscopy, it is possible to observe in its interior an embryo of approximately three days of development. The stages of development of the Aedes aegypti and Aedes albopictus mosquitoes are egg, larva, pupa, and winged form. This mosquito's life cycle from egg hatching to the emergency of the winged form is about 8 to 10 days, varying according to temperature and nutrient availability. When the water level increases in breeding sites and bathes the eggs in approximately 30 minutes, the larvae begin to hatch.
the larvae go through four growth stages. The changes in growth stages occur with the mounting of the cuticular or exuvi as its size increases. The first stage lasts 36 to 48 hours. The second stage from 24 to 36 hours. The third stage from 36 to 48 hours. The fourth stage from 48 to 72 hours. Even though they are aquatic, the larvae use atmospheric air as a source of oxygen, breathing through the siphon. They basically feed off microorganisms found in their habitat. The Aedes aegypti larvae flee from the light. This behavior can be used as a form of identification of the species. After the fourth stage, the larvae transform into pupae. In this stage, which lasts from 48 to 72 hours, there is no feeding and breeding takes place through the respiratory trumpets. At the end of this stage, the winged form emerges. The primordial function of the winged form is the dispersion and perpetuation of the species through breeding which, for the female, occurs generally only once in its short lifetime, that may last, on average, 45 days. It is our responsibility not to allow them to find the appropriate locations to lay their eggs. By keeping water reservoirs closed, properly conditioned garbage, water-free plant vases and dishes, and by keeping anything that could become a breeding site free from water in order to avoid new generations of mosquitoes.
Thank you.